Florida, a new interactive art center is open in South Florida, just across the street from the Rubel Museum in Alapata. It's called Super Blue, and the installations featured have been described as simply dazzling. CBS4's Lisa Petrillo takes us inside. They call it Super Blue, a groundbreaking new art space and exhibit located in a 50,000 square foot industrial space in Alapata. The exhibit is dedicated to producing and presenting audiences with experiential art through large scale artworks and interactive installations. So it's not your traditional gallery where you're a passive viewer, you're actually an active participant in all these works. And we say the artists set the stage, they kind of create the environment, but it's not completed until you interact with them. Four artists are participating. This one is Studio Drift's Meadow. These are basically an upside down landscape that are in perpetual bloom. In this room, an exhibit by Team Lab, which is a collective of over 400 artists, computer programmers, and architects. The piece is called Proliferating Immense Life. If you stay for one hour, you'd see a whole series of flowers grow and die and bloom again. Um, and depending how everybody around you is interacting with the piece, it's always different. So what's interesting about Team Lab is that it's not a video on loop, it's actually generating in real time. So wow. it's always something different. Wander into the next room, a selfie magnet, and it's two pieces in one. See how my presence changes the effects. We have a 26 foot tall waterfall, and then also these flowers that are in constant bloom. And just like the piece before, the flowers are constantly changing. In another room, we find ourselves winding through a mirror maze called Forest of Us, designed by artist Ez Devlin, whose works you might have seen before. Devlin is a renowned stage designer. You might know her work from the Super Bowl halftime show, The Weekend Mirrored Room. This is a multiple story mirror maze that ha starts with a little bit of a video and ends with a technology component as well. Super Blue chose Miami as the first experiential art center with plans for others across the world. Miami has a rich cultural uh, ecosystem, but not only that, our, we look at our audience as experience seekers. So the first that want to be at a new restaurant, a new performance, uh, an entertainment kind of crowd. So and Miami fit all those. I'm gonna stay and play here all day. Super Blue is on as a permanent exhibit here in this experiential art center in Alapata. Come and check it out. It is so much fun. I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS4 News.